have done this in the AFCON, what do you think is next for you career-wise? I don't know. Right now I'm just happy that I got that stage in before and now I have to recover and we will see what happens. They said in the dressing room some people cried before they came out. Are you one of those who cried? I will not comment on that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now look at your team performance. You are now one of the top eight teams in Africa. Last year by this time, did you even dream of it? Of course we dreamed of it. We're trying to, we're trying to make that happen. We made that happen now and it's a great moment for the Gambia and um, we're trying to uh, keep that, 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 that place, you know. We hope we can, we can uh, replicate this, maybe go a little bit further in the next, but first we have to qualify for the next Afghan, so that's the first, yeah, now, first step. Yeah, now that you guys have done this enough, tell me some of the stories that happened in it during the, uh, your run. For you personally, your family, how did, yeah, your memories, how did your family react to you going on and on and on? Yeah, of course, my family is probably the, the proudest people right now on this earth. Um, um, as I said, they always, they always were there for me in, this, in the hard times back in Qatar and was in isolation. They were having my back, trying to keep me mentally strong, trying to, trying to boost my confidence, trying to boost um, or remind me of my qualities. And yeah, they were, they were there for me and uh, I think that's, that's one of the greatest things if you have a family that's left behind your back all the time. Your coach Thank said you. at the press conference that you just played the champions of Africa. Do you believe that? I hope uh, I hope Cameroon will win the tournament. Uh, they are an amazing team, um, and what better thing to say if you went out against the, the champions? So if they let you win it at home, it would be great for, for the for the whole nation here. So I hope they, they can win it. Now tell me the truth. When you saved that point blank header from Vincent Abubakar, how did you feel? I felt happy. I think you can saw it in my reaction. Um, I was hoping to keep that clean sheet today. After that, didn't quite work out, but still, yeah, I'm proud of the, the way I performed. Yeah, when the ball came in and he headed the ball, it was was it instinctive reaction or it was deliberate? Yeah, it was just uh, just instinct. I was just trying to make myself as big as I can, as tall as I can, um, cover the most space I can, and it worked out. He headed it towards me, so yeah, got a little bit lucky with that. Tried my best and trying to save that, but yeah, still. Congrats. It's just not about this. You did. You did. Yeah. You did.